Okay, Debbie. You got this. So. <sighs> Here we go again. Again. Oh, thanks. Yeah, that's convenient. Thanks, other guy. Other guy. Ow! He's gonna punch a truck Ow. to death like this is Street Fighter Two. Well, it worked, didn't it? I mean, work imply worked implies. Oh that shit! It's shit! 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 What? Still behind me? Yep. I think so. Whew. Ugh. All right. Let's try again. Yeah. God, all the sand is really interfering with, uh, you know, you know, with with the, with the monitoring equipment I have. The pictures are coming yeah. in super grainy. Ha. Was that a joke? Yeah, it was. It was an attempt. Oh shit! These guys. Fuck these other guys. Ah! Oh, quit knocking me down, you assholes! And when they knock you down, you gotta get. You gotta get up again. That way, they're never gonna keep you down. You're doing that a lot today. What the the music references? Just references. Uh, I hadn't noticed. That truck looks to be already disabled. So yeah. <laughs> look at all this. Look at all this sand. It's all of, <laughs> the wheels are buried. Yeah. Good luck with that. Oh shit! Ah 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 ah. I don't know, it's like, it's like, you ever feel like you don't have something to say, so you just, like, fill it in with something, like, from a movie, you know? All the time. Yeah. This is just like that, you know, I feel like, I don't know, like, I don't have as much to say. It's like something's... Oh, wow, twofer. Nice. Yeah. Hey. I didn't even get blown up this time. Yeah, ah, yeah, that's double nice. Quadruple score bonus. Well, let's see some dates that are getting ready to ship. Yeah. These ones, not so much. So I gotta stop, stop any shipments of dates going out. Yeah. Right, is it... lift... Wait, are they lifting a van with a forklift? What? Get... Just, just drive the van! Or, like, put it in neutral! Why are they lifting a van on the forklift? Oh wait, no, no, I know. There must be maybe there's something wrong with like the drivetrain, and they don't have a jack. Maybe. That's what you call the car, the part of the car that's on the bottom, right? I, I don't know anything about cars. Me neither. Yeah. I'm not the like five percent of gays who can drive. Wait, really? No, I made that up. No. Oh. You could have you, you could have fooled me. I'm I love odd statistics. It is a stereotype for some reason. Really? I hadn't heard that one. Maybe you're just not gay enough. How dare you? <laughs> I'm I'm trying. I'm trying to. Oh jet jet jet! Fuck! Fuck! I 
Okay, so let's try this again. I have to set the dates on fire while I'm not, while well, the camera is pointing out the direction. Yeah. Don't want that thing looking at you. It takes a while to, for, to set entire box crates of dates on fire. <laughs> you gotta wait to set that crate of dates on fire. But now it's standing right in the flames. Oh, Ow! I bet, I bet you hate when the crates when you're in the crate of dates that are on fire. What are you doing? I don't know. Look, it's like my brain's been empty, and all I can do is references, but I'm trying not to do references. It's like... You know, <sighs> it's like someone just pulled the plug at the bottom of my mind, and everything's just spilling out. Is that a reference? No. Wait, maybe? It might have... I... I don't even know at this point, but I don't... It wasn't intended to be. Okay. Yeah. I'm trying to find another... Why are these guys so tough here? Maybe dates are like a superfood. I am trying to be gay, or I'm like, you know, going on dating sites and stuff. Oh, okay. That's I, met a, I, I met a few guys. Didn't really go anywhere. One I'm pretty sure was, like, Zern in a mustache. And one Wait, was... One doesn't he have a mustache? Does he have a mustache? No, no, he doesn't have a mustache. Huh. I don't know, I just thought... He, do, he looks mustache. like he should have a big bushy Einstein mustache, shouldn't he? Yeah. Yeah. Also, at least five <sighs> five profiles were Conspiracy Dave. Ah, oh, jeez. He... What is... I know it's unicorn hunting when you're looking for a bisexual girl. What is when you're looking for a bisexual guy? Um... God, I don't know. I mean, what's what's like? What's? I should ask Penny at our next book club meeting. Yeah. And then she'll stare at me for like three seconds, and then go back to typing on her computer. <laughs> because that's her response to almost everything. That's Penny. I think finding a bisexual guy is like hunting for a unicorn that's pretending to be a horse. Unicamel. Shh. I don't know where that came from. Okay. No, no, that okay. that's a political system where they only have one house in the <laughs> I have no response. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, now let's find some freshly picked dates to destroy. All right. Oh, it's an arc. Oh, not the arc. I mean, probably not the arc, though, right? Yeah, no. There's plenty of arcs, yeah. Okay. Just places lousy with arcs. Our wisdom flows so sweet, taste, and see. Transmit, initiate the Akhenaten. Receive, initiate the Eldritch Hymns. From inner Egypt came the strange dark one to whom the fellows bowed. Illumine the cult of Aten. Witness the cultists. Now that was definitely a, a Lovecraft quote. That was. Then the fungi the from... The Thotep. Yeah. Well, he's referring to the Thotep, right? Okay, yeah, yeah. Holy fuck! What the shit is that? Look at the okay, we've well, It's it's made of maggots. I saw one of those. That was one of those at uh, the pond. You know. Oh yeah. Yes. Uh, oh god. I can, they are gross. I can smell the maggots now. Maggots don't smell bad. What are you? What are you smelling? I don't know. They're gross though. They're very gross. I'm smelling something. Oh god. They're. I'm, they're gonna get in places. Oh god. It's like a golem made of what is that? rot. Yeah. Oh. Oh, okay. Get out of the get out of the floor. Oh. Floor 
the, he creates the zone and I need to get out of it. Oh. What the fuck? What the fuck? That's a little beehive there. Mm. Oh. oh, great. These things. I remember these down from the tunnel. Mm. But like, wow, this is way... I think this is like way more expensive. I mean, just in the trees. Oh, God. It's just... The roots must be tapping into it. Shh. I mean, all these roots could be connected connected to each other underground. How long that spreads! Imagine. Fuck. Do, hell. Do, I don't think they, do they trees do they trees reproduce by. No, I mean I think they reproduce with like fruit and stuff. All right. So yeah, no, no. These roots, these roots are digging down into the. Into the stores of oil or yeah. filth. Let's call it what it is. It's filth. Yeah. They're, the fields must be down deep underground, but the roots are the roots are digging into it. Uh -huh. Oh, there was. Ah, oh, fuck! Run, Debbie! There we go. We got distracted by botany. Damn botany! Botany is the leading cause of death. <laughs> I'm not sure which state that is. Here. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. I think they're gone. No, we're not gone at all. No, no, no. The music stopped. Okay. <laughs> Wait, you can hear that too? Yeah. Oh god. I, I think it's, I I blame the bees. I thought I was just going insane. You know, come to think of it, I know I can never really rule out th that I'm going insane, can I? No, and in fact, you know, even with all the stuff, even if all the stuff that's going on is actually real, you could still very well be going insane. Yeah. Okay, so that wall is a little too short, so I can't really sneak up on those guys. All right. I'll just do this. That old trick works. <laughs> this is the song for sneaking in the date farm. You've got to draw the cultists away. You try to kill them with a forklift. I died. Yeah, you did. <laughs> well, they're after me again, but I got some, I got, at least I've set off the date, at least I burned those dates, so. Now I just gotta hide out for them to forget I'm here. It's a good thing none of them think to check in, like, tiny little Assassin's Creed hiding places. Yeah, you know, I've actually, I've actually seen the city, the city down the bench thing work. <laughs> I mean, I could see that, you know? Because, like, if I was chasing somebody, I wouldn't, you know, even think to look at the benches. I'd just be, like, looking for the running person. It's a... It's a... Social camouflage, you know? Yeah. Does it also work if you, like, wear a hoodie and blend in with a bunch of monks? I, I have not actually tried that. What about hiring, like, uh, you know, prostitutes to dance around you? Oh, that works. Yeah, that works. Nice. Okay, so let's see where this is coming from. I think I'm getting closer to the source. Because it seems to be getting worse up here. Yep, you definitely want to keep going in that direction. There it is. And oh my god. That's a lot of locusts. And the, the corrupted water. Do you hear that? Which part? It sounds like a heartbeat. I don't hear it. Do you? It sounds like. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> <laughs> well, 
or maybe it's just that big thing's footsteps. I don't know. Could be that. Okay, I gotta get somewhere that mound, but uh, sometimes I can't destroy that with yeah that mound looks a little bit. Ah! Oh! Fuck! Another one! Ah! Fuck! Is this really the time? No! Jesus, you seriously piss one thing off. Oh, look! Dead locust. That's preferable. Okay, let's try this again. <laughs> Our wisdom flows so sweet, taste and see. Transmit, initiate the anthropomorphic signal. Receive, initiate the Judah Lo Ben Bezalel inscription. He keeps going and going and going. Illumine the guardians and automatons. Witness the golems. That's. Hmm. Oh, okay. That might that at least you know slim down here. Yeah. The insect mound was producing the filth, which was being absorbed by the roots of the plants. Okay. I think there's a life cycle here. Oh, good. One of those again. Remember how much fun we had with the drug? Yeah. Satanists. Atonists. Atonists. It's pronounced Aten? gif. Gifists. Ot. Yeah. <laughs> Autumnists. Autumnists. Uh, you expect radical worship and signs of sunstroke, but not this level of administrative competence. Certainly not the ability to organize fill shipments and drive a stick. Assume the cult just start at the mercy of someone smarter than themselves. Faith heads always are. They can deal with the filth outbreak among the villagers, but once it seeps into the broader commercial network, it starts to affect our bottom line. Fuck you, KG. Fuck you hard. Fuck a cactus sideways. Fun fact, a shipment of date molasses got flagged in Alexandria. We're pretty sure it's the only one that made it out. Fingers crossed. Ooh. Oh, there's the air and drifter I was looking for. Not one of these guys. What even are they? I'm sure we'll find out, and we won't like the answer. Oh, Come on, Debbie, get out of it! There we Had a cool giant axe. You gotta, you, you gotta go back and steal that. It vanished. Oh man. All right, let's go back and talk to. What's her name? Damn it! What is her name again? Um, I, I don't know. I just remember her, her hair and her fashion sense. Ampara Osorio. Yeah, yeah, that's that's it. That sounds right. That sounds like the name you'd expect a Council of Venice person to have. Apparently she's Colombian. Really? Huh. Ba 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 salami to you too. <laughs> Wait, was that racist? A little bit. I mean, it—it's going to be hard not to be racist in this in this setting.
And a tiger in the sheets. No, no, Roberto. Está bien. Lo siento. We are being extra cautious. Not only are we under constant attack, there have recently been... attempts on my life. This village is divided, neighbor against neighbor. You have seen how it is. And also, people vanish, taken from their homes in the middle of the night, made into... I don't know what they are. Slaves of Aten? Mindless tools of the sun cult. Oh, hijo de puta. And nobody dares that. to talk. Me even too. when the streets are getting emptier by the day. Soon, the cultists will own this town and everyone in it. Ay, muy mal. So, I receive word from the council, and they finally sent someone. An official. A single agent. A chingada. After what I tell I them in this one. place. But I only have their word for it. That was a week ago, and the agent is nowhere to be found. Perhaps my colleague has been taken as well? I have no way of knowing. I fear I may be next. That's, uh... Wait, wait, was she, was she, was she, was she flirting with me? I, I don't know. She might have been. I feel like... Go talk to her. Go on. I think she likes you. I come from San Basilio de Palengue in Colombia. And that is a Wait, kind of a that? secret world in itself. Good question. Going home feels almost like traveling in time. It's a beautiful thought. My grandmother, bless her soul, was an adept in the old earth magics in witchcraft. I've seen firsthand what magic can do in the right hands and in the wrong hands. This is why I joined are? the Council of Venice. The wrong hands. I believe we need an agency to govern and regulate these forces. Forces so great, I'm certain we haven't even begun to understand them yet. This place, Almeraya, it's a viper's nest. I'm no stranger to vipers, but these are more venomous than most. I don't feel safe here. The Maria are trying to root out the snakes, but despite their courage and conviction, they are few, and the cultists are like grains of sand in the desert. The villagers, well, they are either too scared to do anything, or they too worship Aten. Like I said, it's a nest of vipers. You stick your hand in, you might get bit. Your help is desperately needed, but be careful out there. Watch your back. You can never know who to trust. I think, I think that you'll never know whom to trust. <laughs> oh, shut up. Buenos dias. So gay. Hmm. She can get his number. Nice. Like a Super Saiyan effect. I was figuring out it's a way to perfectly protect myself from everything. From everything? At least for a few seconds. Will it protect you from hurt feelings? No. Nothing will. No. So, let's see. Let's go check out this Hotel Wahid. Ow! Does it still hurts? Yeah, I, just, I felt it in my shin. It's like, you ever, you know, do that? It's like, yeah. step wrong and you feel it in your shin? Yeah, all the time. It's... And it's not like... 
You know, it's like it shouldn't be happening at all. Yeah. Hmm. We really need to get you to a melatologist. The the B doctor. Yes. Okay, but for that to work, they might have to rip out my B, which um, I think that would kill me. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I really need to get like a motor either a motorcycle or a horse. Or a camel. Camel will do too, yeah. Or a jetpack. That would be great. Oh, Total Wahid. And uh okay. Well I mean this is kind of the apocalypse. I'm guessing it's not gonna be opening anytime soon. Yeah. Would you say so? I would say so. I think, like, not even Gordon Ramsay could help this hotel.